Hi, my name is Mitchell, and I'm here to talk about consent. Teens need to know about consent so they don't make the unfortunate mistake of moving forward without consent, which is sexual assault. Teens need to know how to recognize, ask for, and give enthusiastic consent. We're here to help you with this often tricky subject of consent. Great. So here, they both gave consent to him coming inside. But notice that there was not consent yet for Netflix and chill. That would need to be given when they're inside. My dad will come inside. Okay. Do you want to come in? Oh, yeah, sure. That's okay. Me too. Actually, this is not a good time. It's just like a big mess. Maybe some other time. Wait a second. That didn't seem quite right. He came in without permission. In fact, she said no. She didn't scream it, but she made up an excuse and casually said no. Her no should be immediately respected. Um, I'm down. Yeah, sure. I mean, <laughs> you know, <laughs> it'd be really nice. You have sex? Let's do this, honey bear. Come on, let's go. You wanna have sex? No. Would you like to have sex? No. Do you wanna have sex? No, sorry. <laughs> I'm not in the mood. Do you wanna have sex? No. Would you like to have sex? Um, yeah, when I'm ready. No. Intoxication has a huge role in playing consent. In fact, some may say it's the most important. Drunk driving and giving consent while drunk are a perfect analogy. In this example right here, Rambo and I are on our way home. Rambo is very drunk and can be a danger to other drivers. Now let's pause and go to the scene. Rambo, can you give me a ride home, man? I don't, my parents can't pick me up tonight. Sure, homie. Alrighty, let's go. Pause. Now let's think this through for a second. Rambo is very drunk, so therefore he can't drive. The same applies for sex. If your partner is drunk and they say yes, it's as if they never said yes. And if you want to have sex so bad, just wait till they're not drunk. All in all, don't drink and drive, and don't have sex while drunk. It doesn't benefit anyone, and in the end, it could cause potential dangers. Consent is simple. Get the yes before you get no. But for many of us, this is a new rule. And we still need to work on and remember that no means no. Don't push it. Don't question it. And don't try to change a no to a yes. No means no, and yes means yes. It's just as simple as that. Goodbye. We did it, lads!